I'm Ushrasta and you're watching the Love Light News. Let's start with the college headline. Power Workshop Session 6 successfully commenced. Deed of Light News conducts video screening session. Deed of Light Sports Club announces registration for Fantasy Premier League. Dearwalk Literature Society conducts story writing competition. And the national headline is Government should give top priority to education. And now, let's have the news in detail. Sub session 6 has successfully commended from the first week of July. The college administration had circulated an online form calling for applicants to different workshops and conducted a selection test last week to finalize the participants for the workshops. This power workshop session will provide seven different 15 hour power workshops. DWIT News, in collaboration with Dare Express Club, conducted a video screening session. The screening showcased some of the best video projects for video editing training conducted by DWIT News. The session was then followed by certificate distribution to participants who successfully completed video editing training. DWIT Sports Club has announced free registration for DWIT Fantasy Premier League. The Fantasy Premier League is a league in which participants from DWIT can assemble a virtual team of football players from Premier League and score points based on those players' actual statistical performance or their perceived contribution on the field of play. It is scheduled to start from the second week of August. Daywalk Literature Society successfully conducted story writing competition. Both English and Nepali writers were open to this exciting opportunity. Top three stories will be published in DWIT News and the winner will be awarded with an exciting gift hamper. Vice Chairman of National Planning Commission, Sornim Watley, has said that setting the educational agenda in the country has been a great challenge. Speaking at the 18th Annual General Meeting of Educational Journalist Group, he said that the government had to give priority to education. Around 40% of budget is being sent to the local levels and preparations are also on to hand over different projects currently being handled by different non-governmental organizations to the local levels. Now let's hear what people have to say about this. So one thing as a student that I found out is that we don't have the practical knowledge in the courses that we take. And in Nepal's context that practical uh, knowledge is very important and the courses that uh, TU provides they, they are like great in uh, theoretical aspect of the knowledge I think the education system is more focused on theoretical knowledge rather than practical knowledge students are uh, more focused on uh, memorizing the lines and the stuff they just need to write answers uh, in the exams and I think um, the courses are also very limited and the syllabus is also not updated frequently uh, and the results are also not provided uh, regularly and in a timely manner. Uh, we need to wait quite some while after giving our board exams in order to receive the results. Subham Jussi with camera person Samrajas Resta, DWIT News. Thanks for watching this edition of DWIT News. Visit dwitnews.com for the latest news in and around Dewa.